Howdy everybody, how y'all doing? We're going to be doing a video today on updates on solar and wind power. And as you see behind me, we've got some light winds coming in there. A front coming through and is blowing good kite flying weather. Put it that way, good kite flying weather. So anyway, I'm going to take you a little tour. Let's see what's going on with the power, with the wind and the solar and all that good stuff. All right. I'll show you the garden too. All right. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. We got the garden. Oh, my finger gets in the way. Got the. It's been so warm, 72 degrees or 71 degrees out here right now, and the wind is blowing like crazy. It's hot, but my broccoli is turning to fly, It's flowering. When it gets warm. Like this, it turns the flower, it flowers. But what you do is just trim it off, and it, you know get, it's gonna get cold again. Believe me. Oh, this broccoli is right there. Coming in there, broccoli as far as you can see. I got broccoli over there, collard greens, everything the body needs as far as vegetables. Um, hadn't been hunting yet, but. Gonna be doing that pretty soon. Get some meat on the table and meat in the freezer. But uh, it's been so warm, hot. I mean, it's hard to kill a deer or shoot a deer when it's so warm. I mean, I mean, you can do it, but just you better have it. You better be on the ball. But I don't like sitting in the woods when it's 80 degrees either. Um, but that's the way the weather's been. But but the wind turbines are uh, the winds slack down a little bit. But the conditions are are wild today. It's wind wind winds are wind advisors all around the country right now, and uh, I figured this would be a good moment to show you what we got. Sort of making power. We're selling back to the grid right now, but we're ready for a power outage too. So we got battery backup, hybrid system. There is my uh, garlic growing in a pot on the south side. Sorry about that, y'all. But the wind turbine just cranked up on wind max. It's still running strong. All right, let's see if the system. Everything's set at a 37 degree angle for, for, for through now until February. Um, um, then we'll get back to a 45 degree angle. But yeah, and there's a big 1,060 water rate. Whoops, need to do that. Sorry about that, folks. Yeah, but she's doing good right. So the Kira Sierra 3,000, 1,060 water rate. The 1610 watt array up here on um, 1610. That's those two panels. The ones on the back and over here and right here. This you're going to the grid tie off grid system on the other side. 610 watts, including those panels, monocrystalline panels. Alright. Let's see. Come on, kitty, kitty, kitty. There's Solar Kitty right there. That's Oxy. She's a good kitty. She's 16 years old. Woo, she's old. she's getting old. she's getting old, but she's still hanging in there. Alright. Um, yeah, it's been a heck of a adventure and with the land, the new property, uh with getting the cabin there and just it's it's never a dull moment around the wire place. Let me tell you what. But yeah, we're keeping this little place. Um. But anyway, I'll show you what the wind's doing. Watch out, Kiki. It's it's hit or miss. Watch out. Keep me, honey. All right. Let me turn some lights on here for y'all. And there's old midnight solar surge protection device. All right. 
Here's our barometric pressure. She dropped a lot. She's still dro dropping, I believe. Or might be going up. We'll see here. Get some more lights. I'll show you what the barometric pressure is doing. And, uh, wow. I'm biting things up. But it's gotten so dark outside right now from the drawing 20 watts there out of the flat arrays on the roof we're drawing in I'm watching nothing right now on the on the 1610 watt array and the garden array is went to sleep there's not enough power it's 4 13 in the afternoon too it's getting late all right and our, we're at 76 degrees Fahrenheit. We're a diverge, diverging controller. We're at 6 mile an hour winds, 15 mile an hour last gust. And right now we're not selling back any power. And we're only at 26.2 volts. So we're going to sit back here a minute and the, yeah, the barometer is dropping, y'all. It's dropping like crazy. Um, today so far, we've had a it's a FlexNet DC is right here. Ten thousand seven hundred ninety so far. Okay, back we've made seven point eight, but with the wind. 10, 7, 9. That wind helps out on the windy days. When you have wind, that is. Shuts B, that's my wind turbine. 740 watts. And let's get out of there. We are making power with the wind turbine while I'm sitting there talking. Alright. That's going to be a long, probably a long video. But we'll show you what's going on with everything just waiting on a gust of wind and there's I like my analog meters my blue seas meter and meter and my tristar I can move that from volts to watts that's watts right now. So, I can't top my other video when the maximum wind power with the Davis weather instruments and all that good stuff, but we'll show you a little, little kick in the wind here in a second. Here we go. That green light just turned on, I mean, she's charging. Well, that was a nine mile an hour, eight mile an hour wind. Uh, the green light still charge. I mean, just charging. Every little bit helps. I mean, get back to vote, y'all. There we go, folks. Let's see, see what's going on. Okay. It's hard to get it all in here. There we go. This is like waiting on a snowstorm. Zoom in here. Oh yeah, she's kicking. Twenty-eight point two volts. And I'll show you the wind, kind of a little bit of everything. Using my cell phone, it's kind of 
it's convenient. Pull this thing out, bam, make a video. That way you see the analog meter, the everything, the volts. So you're getting kind of hairy out there. I want to see about 25 mile an hour wind, like what I like to see. All right. Just got a six. Y'all can see that up there. A six, eight. There we go. And that green, when that green light comes on, that Bogart drive magic, that means it's making power. The wind terms are making voltage, in other words. Now we're solving. Oh yeah, we're selling back now. Sorry about that. Slap me. But it's November the 15th. And it's 71 degrees outside. You see the other meter right there means we're putting out 16, 14.8 watts. So we're still selling. That's a good thing. Oh, yeah. Crank on, bubble. Crank on. A good eight mile an hour wind, six, six or seven, then when she starts making power. But you can hear him hum in the background. Just a humming away. The wind turbines. I've got the fans in here to keep everything nice and cool. Electronics and all the equipment. They go they go year round. I mean during the day. All right, here we go. Good power. Every bit of wind we're making is going back to the grid. Or to the house, that is. We're using all of it up, but believe, believe me, you. All right, well, I'm going to have to cut this video short because we could be out here all day long waiting for the wind to get some get some awesome amperage. We have a little bit longer. We just had a 15, that last big gust. Here we go. There's 11. It's a good wind too we're getting. The sun's popping out now. So we're still making power over there on the other side. That big Bogart there to the uh the big one there there to the uh, on on top of the inverter. Right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is that a 21 mile an hour wind? 6.3 amps, 4.9. Yeah, that's awesome. That's what I'm talking about. And the sun's starting to, you see right there, the sun's starting to pop out, pop through. But it's 422, the sun is starting to get behind the trees this time of year. All right, well, let's wrap this puppy up.
all right y'all hey i want to thank y'all for watching and uh we'll be back again for some more videos and uh hey y'all take care and everything's gonna be okay um just practice safety and all that good stuff everything's gonna be all right like i've been saying since last march Woo! it's a sec y'all i'll be glad when this stuff's over but it is what it is just take it with one day grand song. hey by the way my uh, my nephew Harry, give him a shout out. He is leaving for, um, he's at the Mets building, now, leaving for the Marine Corps. Hoorah. So I wish him a lot of luck. And I didn't sugarcoat it for him. I told him, I said, hey, imagine the worst possible thing you can ever imagine. And that's what it's going to be like. Uh, a lot of physical, but a lot of mental. I mean, that's the truth of it all. But he's going to be all right. I told him to pray every night, and if you, if you hadn't found Jesus by now, buddy, I said, when you get down there, you'll find him. That's for sure. And he was my only friend I had, Jesus. Hey, y'all have a good one, y'all. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. God bless you, Super 5. Hey, give my uh, nephew a shout-out, Harry Simmons, going to Marine Corps boot camp. Hoorah. We got some just a terrible wind just now. Y'all take care now, y'all. God bless us up for five. Please subscribe. All right now, y'all take care. Bye-bye.